how the concept came up. Yeah, the concept. Yeah, y'all getting together. Yeah. Yo, I got my own thing going on TFC. We coming up. That's my own thing. But like, I'm trying to. It's 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 that's 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 something else I want to do. That's that's a personal thing. This this is something bigger. For, like I'm looking forward like to when I'm in New York. Like, like, I want this to open the doors for like different things. Um, How many people is it? Okay. Damn. And everybody, everybody does something in the group. So it's not just rappers. So it's not just rap. You got R and B on the team. Rock and roll. So we're working on a tape right now. Okay, I mean, okay. Respect that. Okay. Let's get it. Oh. See, that's on top, and that's ready for 2020. So, so inspired y'all to. Pick up a pen and paper, start writing, start performing. Uh, it inspired me. I mean, like, when I was younger. Somebody closer to you. When I was younger, I was like, we used to all come together because it was like, I wasn't really close with family. Okay. I was like, my, my clothes was with family, you feel me? Right. So every day after school, before school, we was together, you feel me? Feel me many nights in the trap, you feel me? Like, then my boy Ify, shout out to Ify, he had moved to Suffolk, you feel me? He had a studio in his house. Hey. And at the time, Chief Keef was out, you feel me? Hey. We was, we was like 13, hey. 14, so hey. mad weed, you feel me? mad trap music. Shout out to Chicago. That's a fact. Chicago really inspired me to start rapping, you feel me? That's a fact. Now, let, now let me ask you because um, somebody posed this to me, and I had to think about it for a little bit. But do you think that Chief Keep um, inspired a lot? Was going on today? Like, do you think he was a trendsetter? Nah, like no, no funny shit. Not gonna hold you. <laughs> he played a big role in a lot of people's life. Like, yeah, for real, like just through music. Okay. Like, word, just through music. And hey, listen, I fuck with Keith because of one song, Kobe. Yeah, I'm a fan, there we right? go. And it's like, just like, <laughs> not even just his music. Just like everybody like that was like listening to his music. But yeah. Also like watching him and what was going on. Yeah. Trying to mimic his lifestyle. Hundred percent. His videos, saying? his visuals. No, like I see. They're trying to be with the bros. Everybody growing their hair out, trying to get dread. You get what I'm okay. saying? Okay. Like he really set trends. Like everybody rocking true religion. Okay. Like, yep. That's a. Good one. That's, That's a fact. A fact. I, I got. I gotta give him. I gotta give him that. I gotta give him that. He did. I don't know about the true religion. Bro. Wait a minute, Jason. Exactly. They been rocking that. So it's, he didn't start no way with that. Nah, but so. I'm th- like, no niggas been rocking it. What I'm saying is like, but like, what I mean as a trend, like everybody had it. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Like, nah. Now, like everybody was. Well, nah. I, can, I can say like. I mean, I'm older, so I I I, I know what's going on out there. People been rocking true religion. No. He nah, just probably made it hot from where he's from. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, but like, like, and for the age bracket, you know what I'm saying, like, at for, the time, for y'all, yeah, may, maybe, but like, yeah, 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 like for for the, the whole for the, high for school was yeah, yeah. On so right. for y'all, yeah, wave, you know right, what I'm right, like, 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 like the, the, the older ones, school. like with two chains, he brought us out for the older ones, but for the younger ones, yeah, like yeah. me. That's you know, a fact. That's a I used to listen to Two Chains, so I used to have True Religion even yeah. before. Like I true. used to wear my True Religion. Don't get me wrong, but true. Like, <laughs> when Chief Keef came out, it was like <laughs> heavy on the truth. How'd you get? How'd you get your names? Uh, I got my name through my bro Josh. Yeah, shout out my boy Rico. Okay. Um, basically, I was. Uh, I came into high school. I was the I was the younger. You feel me, freshman. He was uh, junior at the time. You feel me. Mm-hmm. I had like I had started a group, which was um, FBG. You know what, what I'm saying? It was, 
What does that stand for? It was Flyboy Gang. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Everybody was, had their own swag. Everybody was like, yeah, swag, you know what I'm saying? And I had everybody trying to be on the wave, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. not only did everybody come in together to like chill with me and shit, I'm also like from me being myself, mm-hmm. my true self, I'm bringing the true out of other people too. Right, like the energy, saying, like, like the, the energy, like your aura. You know what I'm yeah. So just my aura and being just around people, I like Zen mode Buddha. Yes, sir. Ah, see that? All right, what about you? How you got your name? Yo, my name's Khalil. Okay, it's Khalil. All right. It's spelled different. C-A-L-E-E-L. Ooh, all right. Everybody don't say that. A lot of people don't know how to spell it. You say like Khalil? No, not, not. See, that's how you say it. No. I said it right? So how do they say it wrong? Yeah. Khalil. Oh, they say it with the K more. K. Pay attention. True that. And how old are you guys? He bought the stats. I got you. How old are you guys? <laughs> how old are y'all? How old are y'all? I'm, I'm 20. You? I just turned 19. Right. Oh, shit. Young. Congratulations. <laughs> On the move. On the move. For real, for real. I mean, yeah. that. Okay. Heavy on the trap. So Heavy on the trap. Heavy on the trap. So who the got? That's it. So like, that's it. Not respected. So that's where that's where really that come from. The whole getting my name. So how about your first? You remember your first bars? My first bars. I'm not even gonna hold you. <laughs> <laughs> it was in tenth grade. Nice. I, I got it on my own my old SoundCloud. Is um it was actually a remix to um. Chief Keep shits. Um, really? The Soldier Chamberlain who did. But I, I, I named it Buddha Chamberlain. Ooh. So, like, at the time, like, in the high school, niggas was rocking with it. You feel me? Everybody had the lyrics down. I went to school the whole way. Everybody jacking my shit. Let's but, get it. And then we also had, like I said, the FBG group. Mm-hmm. And my boy, FB, that I shouted out. He had a studio, so everybody was just hopping on track. So we all doing shit together. But his shit has like broke. Oh shit! And and this is crazy. This was a freshman year. At the, <laughs> time, at the time, I wasn't trapping yet. Nobody was trapping. You get what I'm saying? Right. Like, everybody just getting in. Yeah. Everybody, everybody, nobody trapping. But nobody like like. And the thing is like, and I everybody was bad kids. You get what I'm saying? So. Mommy and daddy not always coming through. That's a fact. Listen, know we listen. turning up when we get to school. You know listen, man, saying? listen, so, man. I oh. know how it go. I, After that, I got like... It was, a whole no, it was a whole nother world once we got to school. All right, hold on one second. Get on our own type shit, so... Hold on one second. Hey, hey, keys to the streets. Yo, this computer was good. Hey, what's Yo, good? What's good? What up? Computer's on the line. What up, dog? What's going on, bro? What's good? What's good? Anything good? You already know what it is, bro. All right, what's the vibe? What's the vibe? Where you calling from tonight? Uh, I'm in the boogie down right now, man. All right, BX in the building. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, somebody, somebody else trying to call. Hold on one second. What's up? Somebody trying to call. Yeah, yeah. Hold on one second. The hotlines are blinging tonight. Hotlines are blinging. Try to get this other one down. Okay. All right, so, it's a computer. Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, what's good? What's good, dog? Yeah, I see. Yeah, so, yeah. I told one person one time they called another. T- All right, we good now. Okay. All right, so, yeah, what's so, what's going da- so what's going down in the Bronx tonight? Oh, man, cold, cold as shit, you know what I'm saying? Um, this be- the Bronx is still the Bronx, man. You know, as I remember gro- from growing up in the, you know, between Harlem and the Bronx, so BX is still BX. You already know. You, you know, still gutter. <laughs> <laughs> still gutter as ever. You know that New York gritty. All right, well, welcome. Yeah. It's- so welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. Um, give us thank a you, look- thank you. 
Just give us a little background. What you got going on for, well, you know it's about to be a new decade, but how's your 2019 as far as project-wise? How's that been going for you? Oh, man, it's been a, ble it's been a blessing, man. It's been, um, been truly a blessing, man, to be able to have accomplished what I've accomplished to bring in new, the new year, you know what I'm saying? Big so facts. I definitely um, am thankful. It's a big facts, big facts. Yeah, we got a few artists in the house. We, uh, um, now, as far as 2020, what do you have going on as far as visuals and uh, music? We know that you're down with Rock Boy G's, a DR period. Mm -hmm. Um, that's a strong movement. We just had Miss Sheikha on, so we, so we know that y'all got a lot of projects going on for 2020. Yeah, we got my movie coming out on Netflix, um, Catching the Body. Oh shit! Um, yeah, produced and uh, directed by Dr. Period and Ducati from Fade to Black Films. He just did uh, Forrest yeah. Whitaker, Danny Glover, and uh, Jesse Williams. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to Fade to Black. I know them. I know them for a lot of good movies. Um, I know they did the Tupac one, the Tupac. So yeah, so that's good production right there. Yeah, man. yeah, Congrats. yeah. So my movie, my movie will be out in like, um, like, like late February, early March, and then we got um, uh, the trailer for the um, movie in January. Dope, dope, dope. So what, what's it about? Um, it's a, it's a, it's about a young get money dude, man. That uh, that takes some crazy twists and turns in, in, in uh, in his life, man, to to get to a certain place that he. He trying to get to man, and it's a lot of, a lot of action, a lot of gunplay, hey. a lot of, a lot of suspense. Um, I, I would say it got it got the, uh, the firepower of uh, menace to society, man. Okay. But also the also the um, 